Hello brothers, sisters, family, and friends. How you doing? Boy, oh boy, where have I been at? I'm gonna tell you. I don't even know where to begin, but thank you for tuning in. I thank you all. Thank you. Happy holidays to you all. I'm in good spirits. So, uh, I send this video in the love and the light. I send this video in the love and light. Also, I give you this video per the spirit, not the flesh. And also out of this world thinking. So I give you a higher consciousness awareness of thinking to answers as to why these things happen to me. So the things happen to me and I have the answers. But some of them are different than the earthly the earthly answers you would normally get. Because I'm giving to you once again per the spirit, per the higher heavenly downloaded knowledge uh, to give you the answers to why each of these things happened to me. So today's topic, triple the triple effect of what has happened to me, death of a dad, sickness, and also assaulted. Death of a dad, sickness, and also assaulted, higher consciousness awareness. So a triple Triple threat has happened to me, but not a threat. All is a teaching moment and an experience. Everything on earth is an experience that happens for a reason. So remember the 11, 11, 22, and I said it's going to be magical. No, it was a great test for me. So the first incident that happened to me, and this was on a Thursday, a manager, instead of like just yelling because he had differences with, with my feedback to him, he took it to a confrontational phase. And let's just leave it there. He did the confrontation, but physically. No, he didn't hit me or anything, but he took it to a physical level. So he had anger management issues and also his his also his issue instead of apologizing which is consciousness because he knew he made a mistake he used psychopathic egotistical controlling mechanisms of the lower density meaning he would never apologize knowing he did a wrong. That's psychopathic. The example is you walk in the store, you steal a candy bar, and you, <coughs> excuse me, you go back into the same store the next day like you never did it. That's what psychopaths are. Not good. It's the tendency. It's the, it's the explanation of what they are. Also, forgive them. Father God, for they know not what they do. I stayed in love the whole time. But the thing is, the job itself let the incident, instead of resolving, they let it go on for over a week. He just apologized yesterday. This was almost two weeks. That was one in my mental strength. Could you imagine working with someone who almost assaults you, but you uncomfortably had to still work with the individual and stay in love. So it was a great test for me. But we are, I am sucking out the darkness with my love. You understand how the earth? They don't give you anything that you can't handle. So everything is a test. That was one. Just last week, I, uh, as you can see, I'm getting over it. I was tested with flu symptoms. But you said there's no sickness. No, there isn't. So when that thing knocks on your door, it, it, it tries to enter. I would never admit it. So, key to my healing 
I never admit it. And then the natural things I took, which was peppermint oil. And also lots of sleep. And a lot of sweat. And also pine needle tea. So I took, because if you look up NyQuil, look up does NyQuil have side effects? Do not take, if you take any chemical medicine, they all have side effects, guys. So I'm just re and then my body aches. I had body aches, but I defeated it. So now it's just a little, maybe once in a while, a little something will come out. But that was two guys, two tests, 11, 11, 2022. <coughs> yeah. The third test, guys, death of a dad. So Thanksgiving was Thursday. My dad died on Thanksgiving. I did not find out until Friday that he had uh, passed away in his sleep. I think I told you guys this story before. My dad uh, was very religious. So he was a minister. And when I had my awakening phase of the higher consciousness thinking he had very trouble with that because I started revealing to him things about the new earth, about only love, about uh, being heaven or earth. He had a lot of trouble with that. So the spirits and angels told me to stay back and let him find his way. Also, he said he did not want to be part of the new earth. And that really hurt me because that's also in their Bible. But the angel spirits say we have they have free will and consent and uh to stay back. Now, why did it happen? Now I'm giving you this from the spirits, the angels, a higher way of thinking. We're taught when we come in here, you know, you have parents and you're the son, you're the daughter. Dolores Cannon, guys, this is just my belief. This is what I got for the answer. Dolores Cannon said, sometimes what we do before we come in, this time I'll be the dad. I'll be, because my mom passed away 2018. But it's all acting, guys. You, you choose a script when you come here, before you come. This time I'll be the dad, which is my dad, earthly dad. Your heavenly father, mother God, is your actual creator. That's your original source. But let's go to the earth, guys. This time I'll be the dad. This time you be the mom. This time you be the son. But when you come in, you forget. Remember, they un brainwash you, and then people get really sucked into this earth. <coughs> so, in that respect, guys, a pair of rents. That's what parents are. When you say you're you're a parent, and actually, Ali, you are guardians. You, you are protectors for the star seeds. I'm a star seed, guys. Star seeds are the ones that's coming in, realizing who they are, and coming back with higher consciousness aware, awareness, open thinking, unplugging from the matrix, and steadily staying in love. But, uh... And then I actually, I am is the key word. So when I say I, I am is who you are. What you choose after that you become. So I say I am a teacher. Then I become a teacher. And that's how it, whatever, after, whatever you say after I am, you become. But <clears throat> I was a bad kid coming up. Very rebellious. And now I know why I was rebellious because nothing makes sense. But. In and out of jails, that was me. Uh, I was doing a lot of things, but they would protect me and, and rescue me each time out of the situation. And that's why they were there. They were guardians, not knowing they were playing a role protecting the star seed the whole time. 
So with the higher energies coming in, that's another reason for the sickness. It's cleaning you. This is all cleaning your body, guys. Meaning you need to eat more fruits, more vegetables, more things. <clears throat> so we're going through a cleaning process and then those that don't want to be part of the new earth will not go. There is no death. We're all just spirits, guys. This is all uh, just an experience. But that's the explanation I got with the death. He did not want to. He was not ready for the new earth because the new earth is all heaven, guys, which we are building now with our consciousness. <clears throat> and we're watching the fall of the old earth and the new earth coming in. But in that, it's going to be higher energies and then you're going to see stuff you don't want to see. So it's just his time expired on this temporary experience of earth, but it continues, guys. So death is only the expression of whatever you believe it is. Death is only an expression of what you believe it is after you leave the earth. That's what it, because it's another experience, guys. It's all an experience of the consciousness of the Father God. You're in extension. So when you leave here, whatever you believe death is, that's what you'll see. That's the explanation for what. So I am in a peaceful, joyful mode because I'm remembering all the good times that me and the earthly dad shared. I call him the earthly dad. He's actually your brother in spirit. My father was my brother in spirit in actor mode on earth. So he had difficulty with me calling him the earthly dad as well. Cause I'm like, but because they cannot create a spirit. It's all illusion, guys. The only way you enter is through your mom, through the, but you choose to come here per free will and consent. And then your parents are your brothers and sisters. Playing a guardian role, but they don't know they play a guardian role. This earth manipulates them into saying we are your pair of rents. Which is the illusion. They are guardians. So they always protected me from my own danger because they had they knew before we came here what was coming. As we've done this before. So in the bigger sense. That's what was going on. I was a bad kid, but they was there as protectors, getting me out of the danger every time from my own stupid things are doing, but also an experience. Because now it teaches me what I want to choose and what I do, what I do and don't want to choose. But always when a person leaves the earth, it's a celebration, guys. It's not bad you are going to another experience to another level with your own consciousness because to cry over earth then you are thinking like a lower density being higher density being no it gets only better guys as you leave here so that's the download I got why the death occurred, the time had expired here on this temporary earth, but the life continues, guys. Spirits are infinite. You've been around for a long time. This is not your first rodeo. But as you awaken now, it gets better. So... It's nothing. So his death, I will also continuously get downloads because I'm always in a state of love, which is the heavenly frequency of heaven. Heaven is within you. So I am only love. Therefore, just like my mom, I still leave getting downloads. My grandma went away in 2019. There's more downloads. Because they can reach me because I'm only in the state of love. 
that's the emotion I stay in. Even though the gentleman brought me down to the, I wanted, no, 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 it's a test. You are transmuting the darkness, and this is back to the assault with the manager. You are transmuting that darkness and putting in the light and, and transmuting that whole office environment to only love. And uh, the person, everything is reap what you sow. I'm not wishing anything, but it's your own forgiveness. So I did forgive it immediately, but uh, I am good, guys. That was my triple threat and where I have been at in the last couple weeks. And a uh, special shout out to our uh, brother Nate, brother Mikey, and sister Star, who I got to communicate with yesterday in front of my dad's house. And we talk nothing but higher spiritual guys. And that helped me cope and get a lot of things off my chest. And it was just a spiritual meeting with those three individuals. And I appreciate them. So that being said, guys, I send this video in the love and light. I hope some of this helped you. As I was trying to give you the higher consciousness thinking as to why these things happened to me. And also the test of the new earth, but also how we are, how I am evolving as a being of the earth. And I send this video once again in the love and light. Please like, share, subscribe. Take care. Bye bye.